Right. Now we just need to figure out where Storn is, which I think he's probably still at his house, right? I would assume so. I see Frey out there. Jeez, Gran, your eyes are still that good. Hey. Uh, oh. Um, Storn, I hate to interrupt, but... So, the dragons have returned. Well, the Skull have survived worse. Right. I, uh... I spoke to Hermaeus Mora. He asked for the secrets of the Skull. I'm not quite sure what that means. Hermaeus Mora. Old Hermamora himself. So he is the source of Mirak's power. Of course. We have many tales of Hermamora trying to trick us into giving up our secrets to him. And now he comes again for what we have long kept from him. What are the secrets of the Skull, anyway? Just out of curiosity. Ah. Ancient lore handed down from shaman to shaman since the All Maker first gave source time to the skull. How to talk to the wind, how to listen to the earth. These are our secrets. Nothing of power or mastery. Oh. That makes sense. Why would Hermaeus Mora want your s want that? We know him as Hermamora, the demon of knowledge. It is in his nature to hoard secrets to himself. Their value to him is of no consequence. The very fact that the Skull have kept knowledge from him has merely increased his desire to have it. That makes sense. And that's the only way he'll teach me the final word of Mirak's shout. Which... is... apparently necessary if I'm going to fight him. So it falls to me to be the one to give up the secrets to our ancient enemy. I do not know if I have the strength to face him. The Three Stone is still corrupted. The land is still out of balance, but with the other five restored, it may be enough. It will have to be. You mean you're just going to play into this plan? You're just going to give him what he wants? Yes. The Skull also tell of the day when we must finally give up our secrets. When Hermamora finally wins. As shaman, it is my duty to guard these secrets, but also to decide when it is necessary to give them up. I believe that time is now. If I am wrong, may my ancestors forgive me. Give me the book. I will read it and speak to old Hermamora myself. I will make sure he lives up to his part of the bargain. I hope you know what you're doing. Aye, so do I. Be careful, Storm. That is my hope as well. I am trusting that you will make this sacrifice worthwhile. Father, you must not do this. That book is wrong, evil, against everything you have taught me my whole life. I hope you know what you're doing. I must, Freya. Uh, it is the only so way do to I. Free source time forever from Mirax. There comes a time when everything must change. Nothing that lives remains the same forever. Do not fear for me, my daughter. This is the destiny that the old maker has laid out for me. I stand beside you, father, as always. I am ready for whatever the foul master of this book has in store for me. Oh boy. 
What is it? Storm! Oh. secrets to me. Father! No, stop! I... I won't. I won't not think. For you! Look me at that big tentacle bastard. I don't think we can do anything do about that. Uh, Dragon Lord. You have delivered me the gift I requested. In return, I'll keep my promise as befits a prince of oblivion. I give you the word of power that you need to challenge Mirak. You will be either a worthy opponent or his mm, successor, as the tides of fate decree. Oh, good. What have you done? I am so sorry. Go! My father sacrificed himself so you could destroy Mirak and lift his master's shadow from the land. Go then! Kill Mirak! Do not fail! Is there anything we can do for him? Uh... Doesn't look like it to me. Oh. Are... are you... I'd know better than to ask if you're okay. I... I'm going to need some time. He was the closest thing to a brother that I ever had. Goodbye, old friend. We will miss you, but do not worry. Freya will guide us well, thanks to you. All I can hope for now is that the Allmaker claims him instead of her memora. So... We won't forget what you did for us, Storm Quagstrider. Walk with the Allmaker. Go. No. Deal with the tree stone. And let me say my Freya, last words. I'm sorry. Of course. Can't be! Please, Allmaker, send him back to us. Kind, I know that you're not the Allmaker, but if you could help him on his way. May the Allmaker guide your soul to the next life. Need something? Freya. What happened? What was that thing? I thought the village was safe now. Are you gonna come with me? Return to the Allmaker, old one. The Skull will never forget your sacrifice. Eh, well, I don't know. I feel kind of weird staying here. I don't really understand what you did. But I trust you did it for the good of the village, so thank you. By the gods, I've never seen anything like it. I, uh, I don't think this will go in my book. <laughs> That's everyone. Go. Make sure his death wasn't in vain. Right. I have a lot to think about. You have a lot to think about? Oh, uh, quickest way is the other way. Oh, right, thanks. Feeling a little bit guilty about this. Yeah. I'm not terribly surprised. What are you thinking about? 
Well... Mora said something about me either being a worthy opponent or Mirak's successor. I'd just rather not be that latter one, but... On the other hand, if I'm not, then that means I'll probably be not coming back. Uh... Great. I have a suggestion. If you want to uh, stop in here for a bit. Just get out of the wind a little bit. But I'm thinking... I've got a magic book. So... If you wanted... Arden has the other one. You could ask him for advice or something since he sort of seems to know Daedric Princes better than either of us do. I think. <laughs> if nothing else, he might have some idea of how to... Well... Not die and... Not give the big tentacle bastard what he wants. That's a good idea. And he's probably still awake. I hope he's still awake anyway. Alright, let's do that. Arden? It's Kinoa. Nothing happened to Mordgood, she's just letting me borrow the book. I think I need your advice. Are you busy? Not especially. What sort of advice? Hopefully not with the girls, you know I'm useless there. No, oh, definitely not. So, Mirak is the first dragonborn. And he's the one making things weird on Solstheim. He's being, I don't know, empowered by Hermaeus Mora. And I've just had to learn a shout that if Hermamora is a writhing eldritch horror of his word, should allow me to bend the will of a dragon. Which is the only way I'll be able to defeat Mirak, I think. I assume it's because I'll need to get a dragon to fly me somewhere. I saw him do that when I first met him. Hemeus Mora? Oh, that's how you spell it. Yes. And in case you were ever curious, Apocrypha is just as terrifying as the legends make it out to be. I wasn't, but thanks. So what's the problem? Did you not learn the shout? No, I did. It's the price that's the problem. Hermamora killed Storn as his price for the final word, and now... I think he intends to make me his new champion if I defeat Murek. If? Yeah, that's the problem. Either I die, or I become an agent of the Tentacles of Fate. Kinoa, I know you. You know that I know you, and I'm fairly certain he can't do that. At least not and have it mean anything. I'm not sure I want to take the chance that I could be wrong, Arden. But I have to at least try, and you're the cleverest person I know. I think Zaytest has me beat, but since this is a Daedric Prince we're talking about... I see what you mean. If I had Ingrath anywhere near me right now, I'd ask him. And I'd ask Mordgood, but she's the one who suggested this. I'm working on an idea. Treat it kindly, it's in a strange place. You say this shout can bend the will of a dragon? Supposedly. I'm kind of short on time and haven't had a chance to test it. I don't want to give Mirak any more chances to steal dragon souls out from under me or gain any more power any other way. So you've confirmed with certainty that he is dragonborn? Yep, as certain as I can be. Think your shout will work on someone with a dragon's soul? Or several? Maybe. Hermamora ranks dragons above mortals for some reason. Well, I'm not sure it will do anything, but if anyone on Nern can make a shout like that bend the will of an ancient dragonborn, it's going to be you. Even if I'd learned the shout, I doubt I could do it. You seem very confident about that. Even if I could bend Mirak's will, what would be the point? What's the goal? The goal would, ideally, be to get him out of Mora's grubby pincers, right? The deal is that if you kill him, you become his next puppet? I think so. Which means as long as Mirak is alive, but Mora's influence on him is broken, I'm free. And so is Mirak. Which, I'm not sure that's a good thing. Better than him having another dragonborn under his power. And if it doesn't work? You could always try bending your own will? That's... 
A terrifying idea. But it does give me hope. Thank you for that. Any time. Good luck. Please live. I'll do my best. Kind guide me. Alright. Let's get going. I think I have... Half an idea. The other thing is I don't actually know if I can deal with the tree stone now, or if I have to actually defeat Mirak for that to be the case. Hey! Well, all we can do is try, huh? True. Very true. I should probably make sure I actually know that shout, huh? Boy. Do I know where I'm going? Yes, I seem to. Here we are. So, you have any idea how to not wizard and help a little? Yeah, I think so. He reminded me of something. Oh? Yeah. I'm stronger than I give myself credit for. Hey. <laughs> I mean, I think that's true for a lot of people, but you especially. Here we reclaim. All right. What faithless minds have stolen. Thank you, kind. Far from ourselves. Grows ever new to us. Oh, this is a weird spot. Yeah. Our eyes once were blinded. Just a little bit of reassurance now before we, him do before I, I try to do this. Well, it now looks like you're gonna have to. Yeah. And when the world shall listen. Watch over my body while I do this? Hey, always. When the kind guard you. And we'll make her uh, keep you or something. here again. I'm not sure if I'll need to bend anyone's will immediately. I'm not even sure where I'm going. What's this? Uh. I don't know and I don't like it. I forgot about those things. Okay. Right, just follow the path. Not a place for fools or cowards. Let's not be either of those things. I hope. That reminds me. 
going to be more useful than a shield, I think. The, there he is. There we go. Anybody else? I forgot how much I hate this place. Boneless slims. That sounds pleasant. Not really. Sounds like seekers. Tentacle face. Hi. That'll do. Suppose I could be trying to use dragon aspect on some of this, but. Slappies. Hello. Ow. Delving pincers. I feel like I'm about to be set up for a riddle here. Or a maze. Or both. Excuse me, where does that open? Wait, no. Ah! Aha! Oh, I don't like that. Oh, I forgot. Oh, those are awful. The Daedric Prince of... Spatial Unease. I don't like it at all. Okay, why are the things different colors? Guess I'll find out. Follow the green ones, maybe. Maybe. Another one of these things. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm gonna... Great. Great, I see what I'm up against. A little bit. Okay. I wonder if those fit. It... sort of. I'd rather have those on- hello. I'd rather have those on than my normal gloves, I think.
Nope. They look cool. They feel cool, but... They're not... Oh, uh, I think that's the book I'm looking for. Yes, it is. Of course. It's probably not the best idea to go sprinting through this place, considering the abundance of seekers. And the fact that I am at all times two steps away from getting flung off the edge and into a pit of writhing disaster. Prying orbs. So, the creepy eyeballs. Do I have to remember what order these go in? Probably. Boneless limbs, delving pincers, creepy eyeballs. Hello. Questionable architecture. I assume that's not going to be the fourth one. Hello. There's two. I could have gotten two. That wasn't the real one. That was the real one. Always make sure you know what the real one is. Self. This place is just perfectly designed to... Be a complete labyrinth. That could come in handy. Okay, 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 okay. Nope, 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 nope. Ah! So the walls have a tendency to close in on you. Nice! I like it. Hmm, not you two. Ow. Hi! Whoa! Uh, okay. Uh huh. That just happened. That was fun. Ugh. It's also- this place is also tailor-made to make people dizzy, I think. Gnashing blades. So, limbs, claws, eyes, teeth? Something like that. Limbs, claws, eyes, blades. Hi! I assume not the Delphine kind. Hello. There's a green one. All of the green ones, I guess. Too green. There's a green. And a seeker. You mind? Okay. Limbs, pincers. Eyes. Teeth. Probably. Probably teeth? I mean, that's... Lurkers have teeth. Big, ugly teeth. So, I would assume. Ah. Uh, 
Oh, ye, this place is creepy. I don't like it here. <laughs> I don't think anybody would like it here. Maybe. That looks like it's about ready to have a lurker just appear out of it. Don't turn your back on that spooky thing. Yep. Ow. Okay, that's bad. Yeah, don't step in the water. Don't step in the water. Ow. There. Hmm. That could be useful. I'm collecting all this junk that I say is, I think will be useful, and then maybe it won't be. Guess we'll find out. There's another one there. Did I miss something? Nope. Wait. This is an awful place. Hello? Ah, hello. Can't keep track of the real one. There's one over there. There's one over here. Where'd that other one go? I saw it. Lurking. Somewhere. Don't want to get surprised by any more of these things. Pretty please? Yeah, hello. There we go. That is helpful. That's creepy. The updraft of doom. Oh. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. That should be this, I think. Guessing these don't have a whole lot in them, but I'm going to check them anyway, because I have a feeling that potions are going to be good. Eyeball. Yeesh. Teeth. And pincers. Anyone else going to just appear out of the bookshelves? Because that would be about par for the course. 
Yes, it would. Oh boy. It's bright. Can hear a draft. Ooh, oh. Oh boy. Have a suspicion. I don't know if it's correct. But I have a suspicion. First, I have to deal with those. <sighs> okay, we're just gonna charge. Ah, I missed. This was a bad idea. There's one. This guy would get out of there. That'd be great. Hello. Dragon. Where are you going, big buddy? Is that how we do this? Whoa! Hail, foolish. Your Thu'um has the mastery. Climb aboard and I will carry you to Mirak. Oh. So, yes. That, uh... That is how we do this. <laughs> <laughs> 